Today, Kevin and I are gonna be trying some, we have Lesser Evil Popcorn. This is Pina Colada. And I have the Popcorners Jalapeno Poppers, and it's a limited edition. The Popcorners we found at Target, it was $4.59, and the Lesser Evil was from the Fresh Market, and it was $3.60. Yeah, that's not bad. So, we're gonna be trying this first. Lesser evil. It says times rind. Keep it real, eat the peel. Lesser evil times rind. They make it sound like rind is a another brand. Like do you think that's a drink? Rind? Or a, I don't know. I don't know. I, 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 I don't because know. it says lesser evil times rind, it makes me think that let me see. Um no. No, let's see. Rind times lesser evil are shaking things up on the classic cocktail that everyone craves on a hot summer day. Swirling a sweet blend of fruity flavors and only the cleanest oils, this pina colada popcorn is a paradiser's premium snack that packs a tropical punch. It's, I think that's a drink. It may be a drink. Ryan, or maybe, Ryan, it, maybe it's a fruit. I don't know. Um, so this, uh, it's this four and a half servings per container, three cups, 28 grams is 110 calories. I didn't even see the word round up there because it's written in white on yellow. And it's you white on yellow. Even see it. We always have an issue with white on yellow. Um, well, they're definitely not highlighting the gum. 7-Eleven <laughs> used to do that a lot. Mm -hmm. I don't know if they still do, but 7-Eleven. It's almost like they were intentionally hot. They would do like uh, yeah. like the lemon and stuff, and they would do white on yellow, and it's like, that's just bad design. Um, but this is organic, gluten-free, and vegan. Hmm. Distributed out of Danbury, Connecticut. It's ultimately just popcorn. It's not coated with anything. It's just got a powdery coating on there. I'm and getting the coconut. Very light though. Uh-huh. That's all I'm getting is coconut though. So if there's any other pineapple, any, anything, anything else in there, uh, it's not coming through. It does have coconut oil, but it has pineapple powder. Yeah, I'm not getting it. Are what, you? No, what mm -hmm. I'm mainly getting is coconut. Mm -hmm. It has hopeful. it has a lot of holes. Yeah, it's very holy. Yes, quite a few holes. So where like it's all in my teeth. Mm -hmm. The mm -hmm. holes are. It's that kind of popcorn where it's mm -hmm. got just like holes all over the, mm -hmm. the skins of the popcorn. That's You're the gonna want a drink. Yeah. You'll definitely want a drink to wash that down. Ultimately, it tastes just like regular popcorn, though, with no salt. I mean, it's just like, um, it's so lacking in anything. No, there's no salt, but it does have, a, it has a coconut. Oh, but even that's not strong enough to really make it It's light. Eat. No, it's really, really light. It's not bad. It's just like, I don't know why you would buy it again. It yeah. ha they haven't given me a reason to want to buy it again. If you like a plain air popped popcorn that really doesn't have a lot of flavor just popcorn mm -hmm. and then you want something just a little bit different with the pop with the coconut mm -hmm. then this would be fine mm -hmm. if you're used to a really good salty or buttery kind of flavored popcorn you're going to be so disappointed in this. Mm -hmm. there's just nothing there i'm eating all the holes i know you have to mouth. get it all your teeth it's awful um i think uh they could have maybe done of course this company is all about organic and mm -hmm. all that i'm thinking maybe if they had made some kind of a uh, sweet syrupy pineapple drizzle, uh, like and drizzled it on there, or something. Crippling the amount of pineapple. Cause yeah, because you, you just don't get the pineapple at all. Um, okay. It really is ultimately uh, just a plain popcorn. Plain. I mean, no salt or nothing. Plain popcorn with a Tell little bit. Tell us how you really. With a little bit of a coconut spray on it, basically. I mean, it's not even. Uh, these are popcorners. We've reviewed a lot of popcorners, although we've reviewed popcorn. a lot of Lesser Evil too. Yeah, it's um, a lot of Lesser Evil I really like. Yes. Just that one's really fine. Popcorners, you can even buy Ooh. popcorners in the Dollar Tree. We really like popcorners. This is a limited edition jalapeno popper flavor, never fried. It, it has no artificial flavors. 
a classic with a kick and lots of crunch. We bring you a mix of jalapeno heat with smooth and savory cream cheese. A delicious, rich flavor to get the party started or to enjoy by yourself. Seven servings are in the container, about 17 crisps. 28 grams is 140 calories. And these are uh, made in Middletown, New York. You can really smell like the jalapeno smell. Yeah, that's such a nice, it's kind of like eating rice cakes. I mean, not rice cakes, popcorn cakes. It's kind of like eating those, but you don't get any of the hulls. And um, it's crispier. But it's a soft crispy. Mm -hmm. No, they're not hard. Not like a tortilla chip. Mm. I love that flavor. The first ingredient is yellow corn. Which makes sense. And then you get sunflower oil. Yeah, I could just keep You lick, uh, you get um, salt, onion powder, garlic powder, green bell peppers, cream cheese, um, cream cheese cultures, jalapeno peppers, vinegar, natural flavor spices. I'm not sure that I get like the cream cheese flavor, mm -hmm. but I definitely get the jalapeno, jalapeno. flavor and you get the heat yes. uh, from them. But they're not super hot. I mean, they're hot. My mouth has got a little tingle going on, but it's mm -hmm. not like, not like flaming hot or, I, heck, I think Grippos are hotter than these. So, I mean, you know. I think it's great that you get 17 for 140 calories. That's nice. Uh, you get, I think, a good amount mm -hmm. for the calories. And the flavor is really nice. Um, I, it is a little tingle. You get a little, mm -hmm. like, pinpricks on your tongue. But it's not like it's overkill. And it doesn't have, um, I do have to say, the green jalapeno flavor, it does not have a lot of that. No, it's, I mean, you, you definitely get a pepper flavor, but, but it's, it's not, not like, really like strong. Like we've had like um, jalapeno popper, like hers cheese curls. Mm -hmm. Those have a really strong jalapeno. Like yes, jalapeno flavor. This is not like that. No, no, it does have a little bit of that pepper flavor, but it's not really strong. Most right, of the... or those Casey's jalapeno mm -hmm. cheese curls that we yeah. love. Yeah. Uh, those are awesome. Those have the green jalapeno and a little bit of that heat and everything. This doesn't have that green flavor to it, mm -hmm. but it does have a nice heat and it does have uh, a little bit of that uh, creaminess to yeah, it. Yeah, and salty. Um, salty. It has a not little salty, bit. Not salty, but there's and that, salt. Yeah, there's some salt, but not too salty. These would definitely be my choice of the two, though. Okay. Hands down, they're going to mm -hmm. be my choice. Um, but... Um, you know, a lot of people buy the Lesser Evil popcorn, and if you're used to buying that, then you're used to the amount of hulls that it has. Yeah. Uh, for me, it's It's too, all about flavor for me, though. It's too holy of a popcorn, and it, there's other brands of popcorn I would rather buy, like Skinny Pop. I would rather have the Skinny Pop popcorn over this popcorn. Yeah, I mean, if the, if the flavor had delivered, I could live with the hulls. But the mm -hmm. flavor just didn't deliver enough to make me want to eat more of it. Although I really like, I think uh, the Lesser Evil, I'm pretty sure the one I liked the most was called like Himalayan Gold. It was something with like gold or something. Mm -hmm. But it, it had a lot of, it. yeah, it had a lot of butter. Mm -hmm. I think that's what it was called. Yeah, I think it is too. Um, and I could be completely wrong. It might have been a different flavor. But it's it's the one with, it tastes like movie butter. Mm -hmm. Um, and it was really, really good. So, you know, it just depends on, on what you get. But out of these two, you really can't compare them. But out of these two, I'm going for the popcorn. Yeah, mine, me too. So, I hope you enjoyed the video and thanks for watching.